So now we're going to be talking about every way you can break trees and rocks to get infinite wood and granite. So the first way, all you need to do is get a dynamic foundation and then place it. And then all you can do is just push it into a tree. So let's go over here. Whoa, what the hell? Some weird uh, punches there. And it will just break the tree. Yeah, pretty strange. And you can also do this with uh, rocks. If we, let's go over here. We can break rocks as well. There you go. But uh, there is much better ways. Let's make this. So instead of that, we can just put a wall. So let's place a wall. You leave me alone, Mr. Spider. Place a wall. And then all you want to do is break this wall. destroy the tree. It also destroys stones. You cannot break these trees. Only small trees. Place this down. And it will break the tree. You can also roll while doing this and it will uh, be more destructive. You can break more stuff when you roll. So let me roll and break this. So destroy and roll. I didn't do a good job there at showcasing that. We'll try that again. Yeah, I mean, I don't know why that happens. But yeah, it's like a full five seconds. You can just roll into trees for some reason. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Uh, you can also destroy trees with a epic long long sword. So if you have an epic long sword, you can destroy trees and it would be better than uh, using an axe. And it also has no durability cost. So you can just break all the trees and it will cost zero durability. You cannot break these oh my god. You can even break the big trees. Best way to get wood, to get supply. You cannot break stone, you can't break trees. And with the epic sword, you can even break cactus with it, and it also gets no durability at all. So, if I can get flex wood, and it costs zero durability. The episode is absolutely insane. And you can even break knot root as well. So, as you can see, you can get knot root, and it will also have no durability as well. So, kind of crazy. Long swords are uh, absolutely insane. 